Nina has three work items allocated. She can select which of the three she works on first. Hi, my name is Andreas Hense and this video is part of a series on resource patterns in YAWL. Today we talk about selection autonomy. The ability for resources to select a work item for execution based on its characteristics and their own preferences. You can see the behavior in the following flash animation. Selection autonomy is something that we can switch on or off or enable or disable for certain participants. So in this case, um, if we disable selection autonomy, Nina can only execute the first work item in her work list. And um, if on the other hand, we enable selection autonomy, she can choose any of the work items allocated to her. In YAWL we can implement this by a privilege called which work item to start. This can be set by the administrator in the control center as shown here. We have created a workflow that allocates three work items to Nina. Let's first see what happens when this privilege is not granted to Nina. Okay, so here we have the admin on the top left, we have the specification here and at the bottom we have the work list of Nina and if we now start a case and we look at the admin work list we can see that there are three work items gather evidence judge case and write report and um, if we refresh the work list here we can see that gather evidence is the only one that can be started the other ones cannot be started by Nina and if we look at the participants here uh, we can see that Nina doesn't have the privilege choose work item to start. So it's more or less the engine that decides which one she can start. And now she can start the work item, work on it, complete it, and then she has two other work items, write report and judge case. and then she has write report and she finishes it. Now let's grant this privilege to Lina and see what happens. Okay, so now we have selection autonomy. We start a case and look at the admin work list. All are allocated to Nina, three work items. And if we refresh here, she can start any of them. So let's just start with write report. And then judge case, and then gather evidence. And if we look at the participants here, we can see that Nina has the privilege to choose work item to start. So we can see that this privilege can be granted and withdrawn at any time and will have immediate consequences. Thank you for watching.